hello from ski 4566 uh today well this morning i got me some dolly pardon pancakes this is it right here and i got me a a breakfast bowl with bacon egg cheese that's Bacon, egg, cheeses, and, and sausage. And I added more cheese to it. This is what I'm eating today. And then I got uh, some neck bones. I love neck bones. I got them in the oven. And some neck bones that I can eat on tomorrow meal. Milk. I gotta see what these pancakes taste like and what they talking about, you know. Country crop, that good butter. <laughs> and I got me some Gatorade in here with my cup. It's so hot because I got that oven on. I'm hot, real hot. I don't eat a lot too much syrup myself. pancakes i've been i've been had them for i know four months you know in my cabinet i said I, I, and i've been wanting to try them i'm just was too lazy to cook them so i said let me do this this morning okay fluffy soft all right, so you know most of them. They like the buttermilk pancakes. I really I didn't have to have much butter. You can taste it. You know, it's just uh, buttermilk pancakes, and you add the complete mix, you know, with water. You know. soft and fluffy. I mean, y'all, you can taste the, the butter. It's just right. 10 out of 10 for Dolly Parton. Mm -hmm. I like them. It's good. Oh, Dolly Parton. <clears throat> and this is the the great value breakfast bowl that I got. I love these bowls. My daughter, you know, started me to eat these last year. Mm hmm. Yeah. 
good. I ain't put no seasoning on it. It's just right, you know. Mm -hmm. It's good, y'all. 10 out of 10 for the bowl. Mm -hmm. Like I added more cheese. You can add more stuff to it want to but it's good only thing i added was cheese them pancakes is real pretty pretty and brown <coughs> they real good y'all i hope everybody's morning is going good you know at work and everything Y'all know what I found out about the package from Timu. Find out that USPS said on there they don't deliver, you know, to post office. I never know that. And I was like, I don't understand why Timu didn't uh, give me heads up, you know, when I ordered my stuff that that they couldn't, you know, that they couldn't deliver there. So, I'm going tomorrow, you know, to see what I can do, you know, go to my hometown. Because that's what my <clears throat> mailbox said, you know. I just hurried up and got something so he could catch my old mail. So. Mm -hmm. At least go down there. And I go to the doctor and stuff like that every month, you know. And I check the mail. Or either... I have a family member go by and get it. And, and you know, when I had my daughter go down, she said it wasn't even in there. Nothing came, you know, so she was down that way, you know, a week ago. Cause I was normally, I was looking for the package last Wednesday and Thursday. You know, I was looking for her, uh, my friend, you know, to bring it back, you know, bring it back when they come back to my new location. You know, but they didn't have any time. And I've been checking it. Still ain't nothing in there. So I gotta go to the doctor tomorrow then I got a funeral to go to Saturday that's if I go you know so I'm gonna see what's going on with my package and what I need to do and everything because I had a nice little jacket for my grandbaby And if I get that jacket again, it's gonna be about $40. Now I'm not gonna pay for that. Let's see if I can catch it for a sale again in case if they can't. I'm just gonna see, I should see if somebody gonna reimburse me, one of UPS or somebody. 
Cause that was crazy. And I don't understand why they shipped it out and they knew they couldn't do it, you know? It said, y'all, it was shipped to Stuttgart, Arkansas. That's where my hometown, but it did not even have the address, US, USPS, that it had an address for Timu, got the damn address on my information when I ordered it with the receipt and everything with the at my uh, box. So, you know, to be honest, I'm mad at Timu, you know. And UPS, whoever was on the, you know, whoever was on the route that day, you seen the, the town, Stuttgart, Arkansas, you didn't see no address on it. Then you should have sent it back to the location that it was from. I don't understand, you know. This is crazy, you know. And I'm just now getting the message. And it shows different on there than what it was last week. <clears throat> Said they couldn't even ship to the post office. USPS couldn't even ship there. So I like I said, I don't know if it's a scam. I don't know, but I'm going to get down to details, you know, tomorrow <laughs> if I can. I'm going to the doctor tomorrow down there, so I'll be able to find out and see what I need to do. But back to this, if you at Walmart, any grocery store should have this. Try the Dolly Parton buttermilk pancakes. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10, y'all. And plus they got, uh, she got cake mixes and stuff like that that I'm going to try also. So I'm going to try them probably for the holidays. And see what it's all about. But... If you go to Walmart or any grocery store, might have it. Make sure you try the Dolly Parton's pancake mix. Y'all have a good day. God bless.